I'm here in the car with uh, Mr. Luki, Luke Mistress, and Yenya, the genius. We're listening to the Kafar. beats of Kafar and his former band, Belbo Horda. Belbo Horda. Shout out to Belbo Horda, <laughs> wherever you are. In the jail, maybe, probably, right? So, we're going from Big Joe to. Gdansk yeah. because my flight is from Gdansk to Paris because I'm going there for a video shoot with Max Meyer and Daniel Dennehy But there is a funny story with this plane ticket, right? Right. I got my plane tickets like last week to Paris from Gdansk. They uh, they bought me a ticket for today I just knew that at 4 30 I was going to Munich and um, I didn't know like the transfer So I checked it this morning and I was like something's wrong here something's wrong and I realized that they booked the ticket from Munich to Paris at the 25th of May May instead of 25th of April. Biggest layover in Munich ever, 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 ever. Yeah, I can do three hours, but one month is a bit too much. One month. One month. One month. Is it fine for you? Hey, it's okay. At least I'm on my way to Paris. Okay, so I finally got the flight to Paris. Everything sorted out. But, you know, looking at the itinerary, I know it's going to be a really shit travel. And that is why I bought the Chewbacca energy drink, Star Wars energy, the space punch. But I will be in Paris in about 10 hours. All good in the end. I actually got the last train to the hotel, so lucky. Okay, so this trip has been full of ups and downs. It started off well, then it went shit, then it went well, then it went shit. Now it's shit again. My tablet died, phone died, my second phone died. I have no idea where I am. Port du stache, de stache, de stache. Still don't know where I am. So I'm basically using my memory and Max Meyer's explanation to somehow find the hotel. So this is by far the smallest elevator I've ever been to. What the hell? Why? Ah. Yeah? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Max Meyer. We just had a really long conversation. I was already tired, but now it's 3.30 and I'm even more tired. We have a meeting tomorrow at 8 o'clock. Which will be, yeah. Less than exciting to say the least. Oh, you look pretty, Max. Oh, you look pretty, Philip. Is that makeup? Is that makeup on you? Oh, that's yeah. a little makeup. It's makeup. Yeah. It's makeup. Thought... Now, we're now we're looking ready to go. Yeah, I also got the nice, you know, oh. button down going. Oh, yeah. Max Meyer, the heartbreaker. Now we're gonna split up. We're gonna make some uh, some videos for this sh sh company, and then. And yeah. we're gonna go train in uh, Saint Quatre. Six hours later. Okay. So the first part of shooting is now done. We actually redid the thing three times. First time, it was not difficult enough. Second time, there was a jogger that went by right in front of the camera. And the third time, we landed it with some difficult tricks in it. But, like, I mean, literally two seconds before I started the shoot, I just felt something coming down on my head, right? And I was like, okay, so it's probably like an acorn or something. Apparently, wait, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like, Yeah, a bird shat on my head right before the shoot. <laughs> right before the shooting. So we're probably gonna try to get that off because you know it will probably dry up. But I just wanted to show you guys before I take it off. It's not easy, is it? Where is it? It's like here. Ah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's not not perfect, but you won't see it. No, but you can probably <laughs> smell it. I mean. <laughs> Here we go. Here's the shit that was in my hair and some residue of this is still in my hair. Now I gotta make some more shots for this commercial with this residue of shit in my hair. But you know what? It's all good. We're in Paris. It's sunny. Max Meyer is here. Recycle people. Messed up having... No, Hello, Max. Oh, <laughs> six hours on a boat. Oh, I'm freezing and it's hailing outside. That's probably the meaning of hashtag freestyle life, freestyle life, freestyle life, freestyle life. 
the thing is, you see, the weather is perfect. It's yeah, beautiful. It's, you know, it's, like, woo, it's it was perfect. perfect on the boat. Like, I had so much fun. It was raining for four, was raining. four hours straight, but you had fun. Yeah. How do I say this? Okay, I got shat on. What? <laughs> By a bird? Yes. <laughs> Where's the shit now? Like, I don't know if it's gone, but... Oh no! <laughs> there it is! Yeah. So you're basically shooting a commercial with shit on your head. Yes! What a professional, yeah. like, you know, just pulling through. Yeah, but it's not every day you get shot on, you know? So, um, you know, be thankful for what you got, even if it's bird poop in your, in your hair. <laughs> A massive freestyle session at the Eiffel Tower. Yep. Got some footage there. But now we're on our way to meet the French freestylers. Mr. Chara sent me the address of this place called Saint Quatre 104. Represent basically a place where urban sports gather around, like b-boys. And uh, we're gonna meet up with the French freestylers. Do you think it's open, Phil? <laughs> oh, oh, oh! What the hell? It's like circus and dancing and what? Everything. So I think we found the freestylers. And what the hell is going on? <laughs> what the hell is going on? <laughs> okay. So San Katha is basically the place to be in the world. So basically any sport that isn't performed in club can be found here. Basically everything that is cool on YouTube is practiced here. And here are the, the boys and girls. Oh, jugglers and shit. Bonjour. Good What's to up? see you. Ali. Ali. Good to see you. And to fit in with the French guys, I gotta wear pants. You know, that's how the world works. Gaetan's wearing pants. Oh, Mathieu Pierron is not wearing pants, but you know, in general, French people are wearing pants. But I'm just talking shit. I'm just lying. I forgot my shorts. I'm stupid. Max, can I borrow yours? Feels great to. It's training time. <laughs> 